was growing up, family vacations meant taking a road trip to my grandparents' house. Now that I'm an adult, I still love staying with friends and family when I travel. Of course, it's great to save money on expensive hotels, but it's really more than that. I think the best moments of a trip happen when everyone's lounging around after dinner or leisurely enjoying coffee in the morning. What better way to facilitate those special times than by bringing the perfect thank you gift? And it doesn't have to be expensive. In fact, here are five budget-friendly alternatives to traditional house guest gifts. There's no need to bring a basket of overpriced gourmet foods that no one really likes anyway. Pick out something from your hometown, preferably something with an endearing story. I like to bring an assortment of bagels from my favorite New York City shop. They're cheap, easy to pack, and always make for a crowd-pleasing breakfast. Flowers certainly suffice as a house guest gift, but they can be costly and seem less thoughtful than other options. Consider wrapping up a few packages of seeds instead. If your host lives somewhere urban, include a cool self-watering pot to go with it. Taking your host to dinner is an easy and fun way to show your appreciation for their hospitality. But if you're unfamiliar with their town, you might have a hard time finding a restaurant within your price range. Cooking a lovely meal at home is the perfect alternative. That way, you can plan your budget in advance and show off your culinary skills as well. Monogrammed anything is always a thoughtful and impressive gift. But instead of the traditional hand towels or stationery, opt for something unique, like a monogrammed iPhone charger or a reusable coffee sleeve from Etsy.com. Both are under $10 and far more interesting than yet another towel. My favorite thank you gift is always a bottle of wine, Prosecco to be exact. Studies have shown that even experts can not distinguish between expensive and cheap bottles. Pick an economical option that you've taste tested. In my experience, you get bonus points for picking something with a pretty label as well. After you've said your goodbyes and returned home, don't forget to send a thank you card. And perhaps most importantly, make sure the fun happens again soon by extending an invitation to your own home. For The Street, I'm Lauren Lyons-Cole.